Hey, what's up guys? I have a kitchen knife here. It's time to unbox! If you're looking for a solution on remote locations that doesn't have internet connection, you might have those uh, data network that you can use in your phone, but it's a bit slow. This will be a perfect solution, guys. And I'm going to share it with you. Okay, so let's go ahead and unbox this one, okay? Microtech router board. Yeah. There you go. LHG4G kit. There you go. What else? Oh, yeah. So let's just bring it out so that we are going to assemble it. Assemble. We have the ring. What else do we have? Power adapter. That's it. Okay, nothing inside the box. All right. Here we go. Of course, when doing this one, make sure you got the manual you see here. Yeah. Hmm. So we need to follow the instructions here. All right. I'll put it there. go in you know use a cable going here so it will come out here like that okay then we get to use this um, on the other end this will be the PoE injector so we get to get the power from this one okay like that so on the other end it should go like that inside so we need to we need to remove this one like that then we are going to put this dude like that plug it there then we cover it back again like that so like, like that then you can push this one to lock again like that so it will look like that okay so we need to put the sim card so I have the SIM card here. You're going to use the SIM card and insert it here. There is a hole when you here. I don't know if you can see that. So it's going to be like this. You okay, push it. That's it. Okay. So we can close this one already. Like that then we need to make sure that things are working so when we're done we need to bring out our laptop try to connect to this one try to see if all the settings are set if it's not yet set then we get to configure this so i'll just go ahead and plug this one to the outlet first so that we can get power okay so you can see the lights coming up power eth user lte so if we get to have a signal then since this is booting up all of those are lit up so we got power now uh, we are not connected to the ETH yet because I do not have my laptop let's try to see that one indicator will light up let's try to see if we can so I'll show you my screen okay I did not configure anything here in my computer uh, the device is a plug-and-play no need to change anything else unless you want to go for the advanced options then probably you can change anything now one thing you need to take note of this first ping or first test we are going to do the LHG4 kit is inside my house so 
uh, it is given that we are going to have a slow ping or a lower ping or yeah you can call it as a speed test okay so first you can already say that uh, speed test is uh, loading slowly I'll just go ahead and go for that go button then let's just wait up okay so there you go okay okay there you go we're, we're just getting 0.4 megabits per second so that would be um, not an improvement on our internet connection on our mobile data okay let's go for that upload that's 5.4 megabits so in times like these you'll experience is one that the upload speed is higher because maybe the network you're connected to is congested okay so let's go ahead and go outside yeah i'm going to bring this one outside so that we can try if there's a better signal okay okay so i've already installed this um, lhg position in that direction i'll show you an app later on so that um you know where you're making that LHG facing that direction or which direction you should be pointing it because it will be a big factor okay so I have my laptop here it's currently raining right now so um, that will also be a factor with our internet speed but don't worry, you worry guys we should have a big improvement here so I'll go ahead and just go for that ping okay so here we go alright I think this this is um, a very big improvement compared to our first ping inside our house that is um, 16 17 megabits per second okay how about our upload that is 37 okay so it's going down it's 28 29 okay so one of the cases why like what I've mentioned earlier the the upload speed is bigger than the download because probably the area where you are connected the tower is congested a lot of people are connected now I want to do another ping because that's the first thing we got we should have another improvement maybe the network has settled down or the connection we have already is um, stable so here we go okay that is 20 29 28 29 28 upload speed so that would be a great improvement okay how about the upload so upload 34 33 okay 29 so upload is still higher but anyways we got that third um i mean 25.66 megabits okay so pointing this LHG to the right direction because it is a directional kind of uh, high gain antenna uh, is very important. So using, by using an app, it can help you get that information. So I use network cell info to get details about the network or cell tower where my LHG is connected. So you can point that one in the right direction. There are also other features like testing the speed and all this stuff. So it's free download on Play Store. So it got wet. Don't worry about that. It's an outdoor device. So no worries. Um, when you're going to install this one outside, you need a pool. We have the uh, other materials inside the box so that you can uh, attach this one properly like this one. Okay. So if you have any questions, guys, just drop a comment down below. Let me know your questions so that maybe I can help you out. And I hope to see you in my next video. Once again, this is me, Torge Pro. Um, by the way, if you are not yet subscribed, consider subscribing. Share my videos uh, so that we can help a lot of people. Okay, thank you and goodbye.